James Robertson here. Gordon May Hall. And uh, we're joined today by Tony Stanford. expect from the show? Well, we have a great diversity of art displayed at our show. Anywhere from oil and acrylics to pastels, colored pencils, graphite, watercolor. We have just about all media represented, represented from very young people to very old people to very beginners to professional artists. When, when, when is the show? Uh, the reception is Thursday evening between 5 and 7. We have finger foods. It's free to the public. The show's also open on Friday from 9 to 5 and Saturday 9 to 4. Okay, but the reception is going to be from 5 to 7. Correct. And that's at the Senior Citizen Center in Malakoff? That's correct. And that's nice. located behind Jake's Skate Park, right? Well, actually, Jake's skate park is located in front of that. Well, yeah, that's what, yeah, right, right. Now, is there anything else you wanted to talk about? Well, I could mention that the Henderson County Art Club has been holding a show for 86 years here in this area. 86 years. 86 years. That's a long time. Probably one of the longest running continual Art shows, art shows yeah. in the area or possibly the state. Oh wow. Now some of this work that's actually back here is your work. What what sort of medium do you find yourself most most interested and fascinated with doing? Like is it oil and acrylic or oil. I paint predominantly in oil, but I do use all mediums. Nice. Well, um, you were showing us a couple of paintings and a couple of drawings earlier. Do you mind if I show them one? Yo. Alright, now this, this one right here has to be absolutely one of my favorites. And if you'll notice, it, it looks like it's paint, don't it? No, no. This is pencils. Wow. Colored pencils, yeah. On sandpaper. Yeah, and you notice the macaws or parrots in backup. I'm no, uh, like, expert in bird <laughs> culture, so... I'm not even going to take a chance and guess. Tony, so these are all local artists yes. showing yes. at the reception. Yes, they'll all be local artists. We have a whole lot of very talented people in this area. In the selection, anybody should find something they like at the show. Every, most everything at the show will be for sale. Uh, it is a judged show. Andrew Wages from Dallas is judging the, the paintings. Deborah Woods is judging the photography. Joanne McElroy is judging the children's art. If you want to see something fantastic, come in and look at what these young people do. It'll blow you away. I believe you're exactly right. Like right. we're we're in here right now in the, the 211 gallery, and just seeing what local artists can really do is really kind of just, you know. It's unsettling the water, but it's making it to where it's nice to swim. <laughs> like, uh, Tony, we can't thank you enough for coming out, or letting us come to you for that matter. Like, uh, your work is fantastic, and I'm almost 100% sure that the show is going to be even better. The show will be wonderful. Just everybody come out and take a look. Now, is this benefiting, this, this is benefiting the Henderson County uh, Arts? Uh, Yes, in a way. Mostly we just want to have the show to let everybody see what their neighbor is doing. Yeah. And they don't know about. <laughs> now all of you folks got some gossip about your neighbor. Come out and check what your neighbor's really doing. 
Yo, thank you so much, James. Tony, thanks for joining us. I enjoyed it. All right. Thank you guys. <laughs> and stay blessed. And remember, we've got our eye on the county. <laughs>